connection with a UART. The way the way it's set up, the way almost almost universally, the way all serial transmission occurs is with ten bits with a UART. Almost, it's not it's not one hundred percent true, but almost it's always ten bits. Uh, and those ten bits include two bits that have a really special purpose. Um, that mark the beginning and ending of the transmission. Start the start and stop bit. So the first bit is the start bit, and the last bit is the stop bit. And so that start bit is always low, and the stop bit is always high. And then the eight bits in between are the data that we're transmitting. The where, you, where are your eight bits out of that? Well, there, I know there's 10 graticules on the scope, and I have, I have one bit on the first graticule. I have my start bit on the first graticule, the, the stop bit on the last radical, and there's eight left in between. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So there's eight bits. So uh, is this one here for three, and this one's for five, or vice versa? Is that what this is? Is uh, as I as I mentioned earlier, you've always got a trigger on the lowest frequency signal. And so if we change our trigger to trigger on, on channel one, which is a higher frequency signal, it's also non-periodic, right? So you, you really want to trigger on a low frequency periodic signal. This signal is very periodic. It's just a square wave. This signal up here is data. It's non-periodic, um, and it potentially could be non-deterministic depending on what your program is. Our program always transmits the same thing. But if I trigger on this other one, I get... I get syncing issues, and when the scope, it's now, it's triggering off these bits, and depending on where it's at, it may lock up or it may not lock, and you get funny overlapping traces. And where that comes from is one time it, it, it triggers on one bit and it draws, and the next time around it's triggering on a different bit. So what you're seeing is, is overlaying of multiple sweeps that are triggering at different points. So they're, they're, they just all smear together. So when we trigger on channel two, um, the lower frequency signal, uh, that goes away. We, we have a nice periodic signal. We always trigger on the same uh, signal. So now I'm going to bump that uh, uh, back up so I have one bit per graticule. And we, we see our serial transmission. And the serial data is transmitted start bit. And then it goes least significant bit to most significant bit. So if you took all these bits, you got the scratch paper or something? I got one, zero, one, zero, one, one, right? Yeah, zero, zero. Wrong. No, that's right. You have a, a piece of paper? Piece of paper. Right on. Well, got in there somewhere. Stuck together here.